morning. So I woke up this morning to this gigantic package outside by my front door. I took a look at the label and it says it's from Abercrombie and Fitch, but I don't think I'm working with them this month. So I'm assuming it might be a gifting. I'm not too sure. I've never gotten a package for a campaign as big as this one. So if it's a gifting, it looks like it's something big. I figured I'd film myself opening it up for you guys and see what we got. Guys, I love Abercrombie sweaters because they're just so soft and comfy. This is tight. Oh man, I love the faded wash on this shirt. Yes, a hoodie. sent me like a whole acrylic box and the lid don't even get me started on the lid like look at this this is dope i'm definitely gonna keep this box and use it for something i might even just hang this lid on my wall because this is just amazing i mean seriously one of my favorite brands one of my favorite cars you really can't ask for a better gift Huge shout out and thanks to Abercrombie and McLaren for this fantastic gift. Uh, super unexpected, but a great way to end off the year 2023. I really couldn't have asked for a better gift. I still get really shocked when I get gifts like this, but this one was probably the best gifting yet. So over the top, just love the packaging. What do you guys say if I try on some of these items and see how they fit?
So back when I first moved to Phoenix, I was still working at a retail store called Dick's Sporting Goods. And I basically had just transferred from the location that I was living before down to a location down here in Phoenix. So one of the first people that I ended up meeting at this new location, his name was Dylan. Super cool guy. He was a photographer. He still is a photographer, actually. We ended up meshing and just becoming really good friends. Well, I ended up quitting at that location after about a year from transferring. And I ended up quitting because I turned social media into a full-time job. So ever since I quit, Dylan and I have made an effort to keep in touch, whether it's texting or social media. And every once in a while, we'll meet up for a cup of coffee and basically just catch up with each other. We'll talk about literally everything from our lives, family, jobs, goals, literally anything. Even though we only live about 30 minutes away from each other, I think it's just such a great way to keep a friendship going, especially when you're both so busy with your own personal lives. I think it's just great mental health wise for anyone to prioritize meeting up with a close friend or family member every once in a while to do something that you both enjoy whether it's getting coffee or a hobby or literally anything else just spending some quality time with them it may not have the same effect on you but for me i've noticed that it almost makes me feel kind of refreshed afterwards whenever i go get coffee or spend time with some friends or family i just feel more refreshed more creative and more motivated afterwards to get back to work get back to my normal life anyways before i ramble on too much because i tend to do that a lot uh, i'm actually going to meet up with dylan right now for a cup of coffee so let's get dressed so since it is 55 degrees out which is actually pretty cold for the phoenix area i want to keep this outfit super comfy and casual yet super warm and cozy Let's get into it. First, I'm gonna start with these relaxed fit jeans from Wrangler. And these are probably my favorite jeans out of my collection. I just love the wash and the fit on them, which just makes them my go-to pair. And I'm actually gonna keep this t-shirt. This is the Uniqlo Airism tee. And it's probably my favorite t-shirt out of my closet as well. Then I'm gonna throw on this half zip sweater from Abercrombie. And guys, I'm being honest when I tell you that I absolutely love Abercrombie sweaters because they're some of the softest sweaters that you'll ever come across. And so I'm just now realizing that this outfit consists of nothing but my daily go-to items. <laughs> We're gonna go with another go-to item and I'm gonna wear these all white Air Force Ones. 